One person died after a crash of the Lakeshore neighborhood this morning. It happened at the intersection of Cassett and San Juan Avenues, shutting down roads in that area for nearly five hours. News for Jack's reporter Aaron Farrar shows us the extent of the damage that was left behind. That crash happened right at this intersection. You still see some of the debris scattered on the sidewalk, but the SUV involved was sent from here all the way over here into the building of the San Juan Corner Store and Wine, where the cleanup is just starting. You see the ice merchandise are destroyed, glass shattered, windows broken out, and plenty of debris scattering the nearby sidewalk. This is surveillance video moments before the collision. The SUV is on the left of your screen. The dark gray car is on the right of your screen. We're not showing the entire video because of the circumstances. This view was something Deidre Jackson was not expecting to see in her neighborhood. Oh, I was just surprised and shocked that, you know, this happened at this in this area. JSO says the crash happened around 2.15 this morning. The impact sent the SUV slamming into this convenience store. The man driving the SUV was killed. He is the 34th person killed in a traffic-related incident in Duval County so far this year. That's real scary. Um, that's concerning and alarming. The two people inside this dark gray car were injured and rushed to a nearby hospital. JSO expects them to survive. The cleanup begins as the owner says this is the second time within just a few years a crash similar to this affected his business. I feel bad for him. I really do. I feel he don't deserve this, you know. He's, he's a good man. Officers continue their investigation. JSO says it is early, but with every early morning crash just like this, detectives look to see if alcohol and or speed were factors. Nothing determined yet at the time of this report as they piece together what caused this deadly start to Sunday morning. Reporting, I'm Aaron Farrar, Channel 4, The Local Station.